Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My name is Yaqat Zaman. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. We are learning how to read the Quran. If you guys have been following my videos, please leave a comment. Tell me where you're from. And if you're new to this channel, hit the like, subscribe button and hit the bell to get the latest videos I put up. Right, so this video is to help you guys learn how to read the Quran. So inshallah, I'm going to be showing you verses of the Quran. And you listen to how I recite and then you recite after me. Very simple, inshallah. And we'll see how you improve in your recitation. So this is basically the verse that you're, you're going to see. Let's see how you understand this then. So, أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم Right, then obviously you check how you recite it, I recite it. And then the same with this one as well. So remember, you'd pause it, you'd have a go, you'd listen to how I recite it, then you see the improvements that you can make, inshallah ta'ala. Now this, A'udhu Billah, Bismillah, comes many times before, so you can just listen to that before. But inshallah, I'll just recite it now. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. So notice the stretches I make. So these are the rules that we have covered so far. I will not go through these rules. We have covered them many times in the past lessons. Right, so these are the Izhar, Idgham, Iqlab, and Ikhfa rule. You can check that out in the previous lessons, inshallah ta'ala. Right, the lessons that we are focusing on at the moment are these rules. Okay, so this is known as the Mad Asli rule. Right, so if you have a wow with a Dhamma before it, you say ooh. If you have an Alif with a Fatha before it, you say ah. And if you have a Ya with a Kasra before it, you say e. Ooh. Uh, e. Fantastic. Right, so this is what we are going to be covering today, inshallah. You can pause it here, you can have a go at trying to recite it yourself to see how much you can read. And otherwise, you can start with this then, inshallah. So have a go at this, pause the video when you see fit, and then inshallah, have a go at reciting it yourself. So shall we have a go at reciting this? No? You want to have some chance? Okay, so have a go. Put your camera in front of you, record yourself reciting, then watch yourself. وَلِيَقُولَ وَلِيَقُولَ Right, so notice there, قُو قُو Right, so there's a mad stretch there. لَلَّذِي ذِي نَفِي Stretch. قُلُو بِهِمْ مَرَضٌ وَالْكَا Stretch. فِيرُو now, ma stretch, the stretch, a rod stretch, the law stretch, who be her stretch, the stretch, methalan kadalika stretch, you did the law stretch, who may yesha stretch, why the stretch, may yesha. See those. Now, if you notice over here, you have yaqū di fi qulū ka firu ma the ara dalla. The word Allah always has a stretch in there. Okay, so I'm not going to always highlight it. So over here, I've highlighted it. Dalla. Over here, I have not highlighted it. Biha the stretch ka the stretch. Yahdi stretch and Yasha stretch. Now, besides that, you also have the other noon, tanu, tanu, noon sakin and tanween rules over here. So, for example, like you have Mara do, do join together. Idram. Tanween with the wow after it. So, you join together. Mara do wal kafiruna. And over here, you have Mathalan kadalika. So, you have over here Ikhfaru, nasal sound rule. مَثَلًا كَذَلِكَ And then over here you have a noon sakin with a ya, so you join them together, right? so joining. مَنْ يَشَاءُ right. And over here as well, noon sakin and a ya, join them together. إِدْغَامْ مَنْ يَشَاءُ So if you read all this together, this is how it should sound. وَلِيَقُولَ الَّذِينَ فِي قُلُوبِهِمْ مَرَضٌ وَالْكَافِرُونَ وَالْكَافِرُونَ مَاذَا أَرَادَ اللَّهُ بِهَذَا مَثَلًا 
مثلا كذلك يضل الله من يشاء ويهدي ويهدي من يشاء Fantastic. Excellent. MashaAllah. Well done. Let's have a go at the next one then, inshaAllah. All right. So let's see how this one recites. Okay. You ready for this then? So remember, try your best. Pause it, I would say. Try to recite it. وَمَا Stretch. يَعْلَمُ جُنُوهُ Stretch. دَ رَبِّكَ إِلَّا Stretch. Who? وَمَا stretch هِيَ إِلَّا stretch ذِكْرَا stretch لِلْبَشَر Fantastic. And let's have a look at the colors then. So مَا جُنُوا إِلَّا مَا إِلَّا ذِكْرَا stretch. Now if we look, is, are there any other rules here? No. There's no, none of those تَنْوِين or نُون إِخْفَى rules. نُون ساكن rules. وَمَا يَعْلَمُ جُنُودَ رَبِّكَ إِلَّا هُوَ وَمَا هِيَ إِلَّا ذِكْرَى لِلْبَشَرُ Fantastic, excellent. And the last one then, let's have a go at this. So remember, try your best. Whatever you can do, inshallah, is, is very good, inshallah. Right, so try your best. Pause it. Make sure you can stretch the letters as much as possible and pronunciation very important kalla stretch wal qamar wal layl idha wal layl idh adbar was subh idha stretch asfar innaha stretch la ihdal kubar now this over here i'm going to show you something in a bit okay so la ihdal kubar نَذِيرًا لِلْبَشَرُ So over here, stretch. Now if we show you the stretches. كَلَّا stretch. إِذَا stretch. إِنَّهَا stretch. Now over here, if it wasn't for this, we would have said لَا إِحْدَا Now because you have this sakin over here, you are not going to recite this here. Okay, you're going to directly go from the dal. دَلْ كُبَرُ You're going to say لَا إِحْدَا الْكُبَرُ As though the this this ya alif is not there. Navi oralil bashar. Now let's look at are there any tenween rules over here? Yes, there is a tenween rule over here. Here it is. Navi oralil bashar. So tenween with a lam after it. So you have idram taking place over here. Now let's try to recite all of this thing. Ready? Galla wal qamar wal layli iz adbar. وَالصُّبْحِ إِذَا أَسْفَرُ إِنَّهَا لَإِحْدَى الْكُبَرُ نَذِيرًا لِلْبَشَرُ Fantastic. Subhanallah. MashaAllah. Well done to all of you guys. Let's have a go at reciting this thing. So what you see on the screen, try your best to try and recite it. Maybe you want to pause it and then you want to recite it. That's totally up to you. What I'm going to do is I'm going to recite it now. So let's go. وَلِيَقُولَ الَّذِينَ فِي قُلُوبِهِمْ مَرَضٌ وَالْكَافِرُونَ مَاذَا مَاذَا أَرَادَ اللَّهُ بِهَذَا مَثَلًا مثلا كذلك يضل الله من يشاء ويهدي من يشاء وما يعلم جنود ربك إلا هو وما هي إلا ذكرى للبشر كَلَّا وَالْقَمَرُ وَاللَّيْلِ إِذْ أَدْبَرُ وَالصُّبْحِ إِذَا أَسْفَرُ إِنَّهَا لَإِحْدَى الْكُبَرُ 
Naziran lil bashar. Fantastic, mashallah. Now notice, I did stop in a few places and carried on. Um, and that's because I understand the meaning, so I know exactly where the sentence ends. Inshallah, as time goes by, when we talk about stopping, inshallah, that's where we are going to be learning more about where to actually stop and carry on. I hope you guys have benefited from today's lesson, and I hope you guys have a wonderful week. If you can do me a favor and just share these videos with your contacts and spread them out your WhatsApp and all your social media so that people can benefit from these. Alhamdulillah, so many people contact me and tell me that they benefit from these videos. And subhanAllah, we hope that this is a means of our reward in the Day of Judgment, inshallah. Now, if anyone wants to support my channel and wants to sponsor my channel on a monthly basis, you can do it through the Patreon. So Patreon app, you can see on the screen in a bit. And you can also see it down below in the description. Or you can do it through PayPal. Supporting my channel helps the work that I do. And uh, Sadaqah Jariya, these are patrons who are supporting my channel uh, on a monthly basis. And these are beautiful, wonderful people. If you guys become one as well, I really appreciate it. And I'll see you guys next time. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.